you guys won't believe what is going on inside my fish tank. Let's check it out. So last winter I filmed a video about my Frontosa fish in my aquarium inside here and as you can see it's right behind me now. I filmed it because it was winter time, one, there was nothing going on with the plants, and two, because something miraculous happened inside this tank, and that was one female fish that I've had in this tank for two years without any other fish had babies. I got a lot of comments from that video. Some people believed it and said, hey, I've heard of this before. Some people said, you're crazy, Mike. There's absolutely no way, and some of you just didn't know what to think. But nevertheless, here we are with the fish in the tank from one mama fish after being in the tank for two years by herself. So here's a little clip of that video last year of what these little baby fish looked like. They were just so small. It took us forever to even notice them. It kind of caught my eye out of nowhere when I first saw them and didn't even know what to think or how they came about or how they showed up in the tank, but there they were nevertheless. Now, that was last winter. Here we are now in August and I'm getting lots of questions about how the fish are doing. So I'm going to show you guys this real quick, show you how the big ones have grown, but there's something else miraculous going on in here. Well, maybe not quite so miraculous, but it's pretty crazy nonetheless. So I'll go along, I'll clean the tank, it'll look great for a while, and then the haze starts building up on the glass on the inside, the algae and all that, and you can't see as well through it. And then I'll clean it real good and then it'll build back up. And anyway, about a week ago, we were in this phase where it was kind of hazy and all of a sudden my wife walked by the tank and she about flipped out. I came running out here, what is going on, hon? There's something happening in this tank. Something already happened in this tank and we didn't see it because of the haziness. So I cleaned the tank up real good and it's absolutely nuts, guys. First, let's show you the babies from last winter and then I'm gonna show you what's going on now. All right, so look how big they're getting, man. These guys are just growing pretty quickly. I mean, as far as I can tell, they look really nice. I think there were 12 or 13 originally, and they are really taking off. There's mama way down in there. She always hides right down in that little area. It doesn't come out hardly at all. But look at what my wife saw, guys. Do you see it? We didn't see it because of the haze built up, the algae built up in the tank. And then I cleaned it and we could see it, but it caught her eye and she was shocked. And I came out and saw it and I was dumbfounded and I don't even know what to think. Did this mom do it again? They're down hidden. You guys see him under that rock there. He always sits down there or up under this rock under here. Way up, where is it? Way up under there. But he's down here right now. I believe that's a male and at times he turns really dark and he just stays right by himself all the time. He keeps kind of quiet to himself, just like the mama. I think it's a male. I'm not 100% sure. But there he sits. We'll call him him for now. And so that is one of the original babies from last winter right there. Can he actually impregnate the mom? Can he actually make that happen at that juvenile age? Here's the stage they're at. These guys are probably, maybe some of them are an inch and a half, some of them are two inches long. The majority are probably an inch and a half, something like that. But there they are. I think there's 12 or 13 of them. There's the one that I believe is a male. I don't know. Can it already have babies? Can it already make babies? But I counted these guys the other day and they're tough to count because there's a ton of them. Can you see them? There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. They're all over. They're all, there's another one up there. They're all throughout this tank. There's one way over there. They're down, down who of them? I sat here the other day and I counted these guys and I counted up to 30 different new baby fish. So we've got like, what is that? Like, I don't know, 40 something fish in here. 43, 44 fish, and that's just what I could count. I mean, it's hard to count all these little guys, but there they are. Isn't that, oh, there he goes. He's up in his little hole. Do you see him? See his tail? The guy's swimming up in there right now. He just moved. I think that's a male. I don't know, you fish people can tell me maybe. Can he already impregnate mom? Is that where all these babies came from? Or did she do her spontaneous combustion thing again and pop out 30 babies? I don't know, man. This is pretty crazy, but I've now got close to 50 Frontosa African cichlids 
in my aquarium, and this is only an 80 gallon aquarium, guys. <laughs> I need I need a thousand gallon aquarium now, so I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I'm gonna have to figure something out. They're obviously healthy, they're doing great, they're growing beautifully. They're growing very, very beautifully, and they're doing awesome. I mean, you can see they look real healthy, but they're gonna get big, and it, you know, eventually they're gonna have to come out of this tank. There's no way I'm going to be able to fit 50 of these guys in here. What do you think? What are we going to do about this? I keep trying to convince my wife that I need to build a thousand gallon aquarium. I don't know where I'll put it. Maybe in one of the pole barns. Maybe out in the hoop house. I don't know. Alright guys. I think that's it for the fish right now. You've seen it. There they are. Tons of little babies everywhere swimming around in here. I mean, I've never seen anything like this before in my life. Absolutely crazy. Absolutely crazy. So there it is, guys. I think I brought some fish people over to this channel on that last video last winter that I posted. And a lot of you guys are asking me, how are the baby fish doing? Well, that's how they're doing. The ones that you saw last winter are inch and a half, two inches long. And there's like 12 or 13 of them in there. I haven't counted in a while. But uh, we've now got at least 30 more little fry swimming around in there. 80 gallon tank, almost 50 fish. I'm gonna have to do something here soon. I don't wanna lose these guys, I wanna keep them all. I want a thousand gallon tank. Anyway, let me know in the comments down below if you know what I ought to do with all these guys or, or how big of a tank I'm gonna need for close to 50 of these Frontoza. If you guys like this video, hit the like button, subscribe if you wanna follow along and see updates on these guys. Have a fantastic week, and I'll see you in the next video. Adios. Look at this, guys. Just after I shut off the camera, I decided to feed them. And all of a sudden, they all just started congregating down where the food fell. And they're just going nuts in there. Just feeding like crazy. Look at those little guys. Little baby nursery in there. And they're just loving this tank.